Hello everyone, welcome to Hargar Siksha Academy. So today the question that I am covering is limit x tends to 0, 1 plus x whole to the power 1 by x. Okay. So first of all, here we have to know the formula and also remember it. This 1 plus x to the power n is given by, okay. 1 plus nx plus n into n minus 1 and minus 1 divided by 2 factorial plus n into n minus 1 into n minus 2 n minus 1 n minus 2 divided by 3 factorial here you will write x here you will write x square here you will write x cube and this goes on okay and here the bracket will be closed here let us put in bracket this you have to remember always because it will be applied in maximum of the questions you face and in board exam also this is very important so now we will use this formula okay for solving this one now let us extend it limit of x tends to 0 1 plus x to the power 1 by x what is 1 by x here in the place of n we are writing 1 by x so here also in the place of n we will write 1 by x so what this will become is equal to limit of x tends to 0 now in bracket let us write this will be 1 plus now here if you will take 1 by x then what will this become this will become 1 plus here what we will get we will get 1 minus x divided by 2 factorial okay if you write 1 by x here you will get like this okay plus let us extend this like this so this whole is the expansion of above one now what we will do we will just put the value of x as zero so we will get it as one plus one and other all will be here if you are putting it zero what we are going to do we will be getting just one by two factorial then we will get one by three factorial plus dot 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 okay now what is this this is the expansion of e to the power one and you can check it if you know what is the expansion for e to the power x or you can see my other video also which is which is on expansion of x to the power x so this will be e to the power one will be is equal to x to the power zero by zero factorial means one to the power zero by zero factorial plus we write x to the power one by one factorial that is one by one factorial then x to the power 2 by 2 factorial that is also 1 by 2 factorial in this way and the same thing we have got here okay so we can write it as the answer is e and various competitive exams and also board exams this question is very common so you have to remember it and you have to also remember to like subscribe and share and press the bell icon so that you can get these notifications timely and you can prepare for your board exams well Thank you very much. Bye-bye. Take care.